Hey guys, it's Brian here, and today I'm gonna show you how to level up really, really quick. So, um, you know, in the beginning of this video, you're gonna get one of the cards. It's gonna be a money method. Uh, you can watch that after this video, after you watch the full thing, because once again, uh, I show you different types of method. I don't only show you one. So you guys better be aware of that. Um, please note that this is for low levels. If you're like high level, that like me. Yes, this will work, but it's going to be a slow progress it, process. It's not going to be like instantly quick. Like you're going to be oh, 100 to level like 200 like, in a span of a uh, week or something like that. Uh, this is for someone who just started who's like level 1. And this is how they're going to get level 100 fairly quick in probably 2 or 3 months. Yes, I know that's a really long time. But this is the best way to get it legit. Because if I post a money glitch, they're gonna take it down. That's why if you search up, um, uh, like a money glitch, a RP glitch, they take it down now. So, I have to post money methods, RP methods, to post all of that instead of money glitches. So, I am so, so sorry about that. Um, of course, my money method video actually includes a money glitch, but it's very common. So, that's why they didn't take it down. But yeah, if you check money glitches, you're going to see either fake videos or patched glitches. So that's, that's what kind of sucks about it. Um, and yeah, before we start, make sure to like and sub. Watch all the way so you can learn all the methods and probably combine them if you can. And yeah, all right, let's get started. So the first thing you want to do as you start, you're probably going to start, let's say... You're in the airport or something like that, right? So just do that mission that whatever it tells you. And then what I want you to do is go into action menu. Um, hide options, click jobs, and put custom. Now, custom is going to show every single job. I know it might be annoying at first, but after a day or two, you're going to get used to it. And it's going to be better. Uh, with this, you can use the teleport glitch which you just start a job and join a friend who is in a different targeting mode as you. But of course, no one really uses that except for money glitches. And like I said, it's really hard to find one right now. Um, but yeah, once you start off, what I want you to do is to start up a race or you can go on your pause menu, online, jobs, uh, quick job, and last team standing. Now, you want to look for, in the last team standing, you want to look for ones that are not created by Rockstar. Now, you might be saying, why should I not play the ones with Rockstar? Is there a problem with it? The answer is no, but if you're going to be doing the job over and over again, I recommend playing a player-made one because it's much more fun. And the races that I'm telling you to play are Rockstar-made. But, you know, those are, you want to unlock colors and stuff like that on your way while you're leveling up. Uh, but yeah. Um, here's the thing. With the money method, yeah, you can have tons of money and you can have tons of protection. But how you're a level level, they're kind of targeting you. So, right when you start, you don't want to start doing money methods, money glitches and stuff like that. You want to start leveling up. You want to grind your level all the way up into at least 50 because if they see you're a low level they're going to take advantage of you and they're going to start killing you with anything they have most commonly a mark 2 so yeah um if you're going to do the last man uh, standing just replay that mission over and over again if you're the host um try to put max max rounds so it's probably going to be like four if you're doing it with all with friends which this is highly recommended you guys should take turns. What I mean by that is, let's say one of you win the first round. So let's say round one, you win. Round two, your friend wins. Round three, you win. Round uh, four, uh, they win, and so on. And to whoever wins the match, whoever wins the first the first match, like the whole game, is whoever won the first round. And then for the next match or the next game. You, you, instead of you winning the first round, your friend wins the first round. Of course, you know, um, comment down below if you want to do with anyone. You know, those people, 
people might help you out to rank up. Uh, this is also a good way to get money. Uh, maybe after an hour, you get 100k. I know that doesn't seem much. Uh, that's why, you know, you should check out the money method after, because that's going to help you all out, out a lot more. Okay. So the next thing you want to do, the next thing that I probably recommend more. Um, let's see. Maybe if you if you bought the game with a pack or something, that means you got CEO office and stuff like that. You know, maybe do some supply missions because those give you XP. And if you're in a player game, so like let's say if you have like many players like I do, uh, I have 19. You get more XP. The more players you have, the more XP you get, and that's what you want. Um, another thing that I recommend is going online jobs, quick job. And let me see what's it called. It, it, it was called Survival. Survival is pretty much, uh, if you ever played Call of Duty, it's like one of those zombie games. Zombie based games, but they're, they're zombies, but with guns pretty much. And you gotta survive. And it's four people max, and you gotta survive up to round 10. It gives you like 10k, I'm pretty sure, if you win it. But it does give you a good amount of XP. So you do want to grind that off. So pretty much what I'm saying is you should grind off tons of jobs, um, do some CEO work, do all of that. Uh, oh, if you're in a session and it's telling you to do an event, so it's, it says like um, the, the city damage or like the flying upside down thing, you want to do those, trust me. I know some of them require a plane and stuff, but they provide you with a plane. So just grab the plane wherever they provide it. And just start doing it. Um, try to get first place if possible. If not, try to get at least top three. So, if you get top three, you're going to get more XP, more money. But, you know, we're trying to aim more for the RP or XP. Depending how you want to say it. Yeah, that's like the best way to do it. Um, Let's see. Uh, what you could also do... Is you could go job play job this time, and you could go to bookmarked, and here you have all your bookmarked things. But this you need a social club. So pretty much in my last t uh, team standing, I have rocket versus surgeon, runners versus internos, runners slash bikers versus snipers, just versus insurgents, um, pit of doom. BMX versus Zentorno, Bowling versus RPG, and then a few job names. And yeah, these are the ones that you want to try to look for. These are the most fun. I recommend like BMX versus Zentorno. Maybe Pit of Doom. Pit of Doom is pretty much um, where like you guys crash into a cars and you guys fall in that little pit. But yeah, the more you play those, the more rounds you play, the more RP you get. So if, if you're playing and you get a flawless four rounds... You're not going to get as much money as if they won three rounds and you won four rounds. Because that's seven rounds right there. And you're going to get more cash and more RP for playing more rounds. Now, here's a little tip if you want to get more rounds and you're playing with friends or something like that. You want to go to an invite-only session. You want to start up the job that, and you should have in your bookmark. So you should start it up in your bookmark as a job. And I'm pretty sure you could put up to eight rounds. Uh, I'm not too sure. I kind of forgot. I think it's like eight or six rounds, which is a lot more. Because if you could, let's say eight rounds, that's pretty much almost triple the amount that, well, no, sorry. That's double the, the amount that you were getting last time. So pretty much that's what? Uh, they win seven and you win eight. That's a lot more. That's what? Uh, 15. That's 15 rounds. Imagine how much RP and money you're going to be getting. Now, you just do this for your the whole day. Of course, you don't have to do it the whole day. You can take breaks. You can uh, do other things. You can do the public things in the session. Uh, in the session lobbies. But yeah, those are going to give you like the best RP. It's going to give you the best chance. I, I know I'll, uh, you guys were thinking that was going to give you a really crazy one. But there really isn't that much to do other than the jobs. Of course, you could destroy these things, but then you're going to start a war. People are going to come after you. It's not really recommended. Also, you're if you're watching this, you're probably a low level, so you don't have that much guns unlocked. So 
Yeah, um, you're gonna be low level. Try to get at least to level 20 to 30 about. And yeah, um, make sure to watch my money method video now. Trust me, that has a lot more methods. Uh, this, they could probably give you up to 10 mil if you're really grinding. Probably like 10 mil, like, every day, so you might want to check that out. It's, like, if you click this video, you should see, like, a little circle with an eye on it. Click that. Click my Money Method video. And, yeah. Thank you guys for watching. Hope you guys enjoyed. Make sure to like and sub if you guys want more future content like this. Of course, comment down below if you need help with jobs and stuff like that. And hopefully someone provides you with help. Um, and, yeah. See you guys all next time. Peace.